exactly regular, but it is uh, nor a motorcycle or a vehicle, but it is the Xiaomi 365 Mi scooter. It is something that people have been purchasing to go to their school. Good afternoon, guys. This is the Xiaomi M365 Mi electric scooter. Uh, it's created by the Chinese electronics company called Xiaomi, and it was released in December 2016. And surprisingly, one good feature that I love about this Xiaomi uh, scooter is that it has a disc brake. So it, it does break really, really good, especially during its high speeds. And it, it uses 8.5 inches inflatable pneumatic tires. Its length is about 108 centimeters, width is 43 centimeters, and the height is 114 centimeters, enough for you to carry it around in the back of your car. So the Xiaomi scooter weighs around 30 pounds. It's something that you could easily bring in the back of your car or something that you could put inside your office. There's simply a hook here that you Unwind and then you can simply close it because it's only 30 pounds. It's something that anyone could actually operate and carry So it is, it is extremely extremely important. The Xiaomi 365 actually has a front wheel drive motor. The electrical motor is uh, here in the front wheels and the rear disc brake is right here. Uh, as for known issues, there have been uh, not much but uh, some people actually hack these devices to make them much faster than they are. So as for this Xiaomi 365, this is actually the non-pro version meaning that this can only go up to 30 kilometers, 30 or 35 kilometers while the pro can go up to until 45. Uh, there is only a 5k peso difference between the two and the pro actually has a speedometer right here. Uh, I believe this is this can also be connected to your cell phone, so there is an app. So my friend Serge, as a precaution, he brings his charger everywhere. Mukha lang siyang laptop charger. It's a 240 volt charger power adapter. Simply plug it in right here. Ayan. So how do you know it's charging? Lina. So as a security uh, measure of this device, you can actually lock it by just, just simply swiping. And in turn, the, the device would actually not move. So this is their way of, uh, of using a key or this is their way of locking the device. So in turning the device on, you have to press the power button once and that would put it into normal mode and pressing it twice would put it into echo mode and pressing it one more time would actually turn on its headlights. So it does come with front headlights. One also cool feature it does have is when you press on the brakes, uh, it does this, it blinks, so it notices uh, the rear person or the rear car or whichever is there that you are braking. So I think that's a really good feature that Xiaomi included. So I am accelerating slowly. It is a bit difficult, but this is how it is. It's actually pretty fast. It's uh, kind of uh, during the first time trying it out, but it's simple enough and easy to use. I think it was voted one of the most easiest scooters. This is actually my friends, but it's something that I've been considering for a while now because it's so easy to use. You can literally bring it everywhere and it's honestly so convenient. You could literally go to the city and uh, it would be so easy to just park your car and go around. I would rate this actually a very high score considering that it is only 18,000 market price. So I think you could find much more cheaper online especially since you can do modifications on it like changing the changing the wheels and upgrading certain areas. Here's my close friend Serge, he actually owns the Xiaomi device. It's been with him for how long now? Uh, for like about two months now. So, how much did you buy, bro? Around like 18, 18, 18,000 like in market market. Below 20. Uh, actually, the other day, we went there and to our surprise, it was sold out. So much people have so had much it. People, especially Koreans. That's true. That's that true. works here. Na they have job lang. They live near them. Tama. And aside from that, uh, so much people who can't afford motorcycles actually just purchase it. So, meron ding mga Facebook group, would you believe, nitong Xiaomi scooter. So, saan ka nang galing ngayon, bro? Merville. The gig. So, he drove from Merville all the way to the gig, and it was a good experience naman for him. It was 20 minute drive. 20 minutes lang. And, 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 and in doing that, parang one bar lang yata yung nabawas. Yep. 7 kilometers. That is it guys for the Xiaomi review. Hopefully I can review more scooters in the future as I actually want to purchase one for myself That's and ride true. with Ride with Sir. The idea niya is to go around to Valley yeah. and bring this over and just go around. You can just like bring it to your car. That's true. Tama. And then hop in. Tama, bro. Exactly. So thank you guys for watching this video.